Hey guys, so Valkyrie Connect is having an Attack on Titan collab. This is actually the second time they've done this. And this collab is actually near and dear to my heart because a lot of people don't know this. My son is actually a Titan. <gasps> Shut stop. So I'm going to be going over uh, some of the the events uh, this, and we're gonna do some summoning at the end and we're gonna do an everything you need to know about this collab video so first you can click uh, right here we'll get this out of the way click right here or you can click the event at the bottom come in here uh one thing to notice this is where you're gonna get a lot of your rewards for a lot of the things we're gonna cover so exchange for rewards you're gonna get these points for doing like the uh the boss battles type of thing i'll show you that you can get a free character here I'm going to admit, I don't know who this guy is. I watched Attack on Titans up to where What's-Her-Face gets puts herself in a crystal. I don't know if that's spoiler enough free, but uh, uh, that's where I'm at. Uh, I just haven't gotten caught up yet, although it's on my list of things to do. Uh, so you can get this dude here. Uh, he looks pretty cool to me. And you can get some stamps. Uh, if you don't know, uh, the weapons in, are really important in this game because it's not just stats, they're abilities here. So you can see like the abilities it'll do down here. And you'll need a lot of duplicates of these things to max them out. I think, what is it, like possibly like 12 at most to get like a full 5-star weapon. If you're using duplicates of the same thing, it might be a little different here. But the point is you're going to want a lot of duplicates of the weapons to get them as high rarity as possible. You can do that by combining them or you can get other uh, resources that will help you do that as well. Um, there's also Odd Fruit. This will help you increase the like permanent stats of the character, things like that. But of course, the main thing to go for is the character because he's dirt cheap. Uh, the stamps are cool. And then maybe the, the and the weapons are what I'm going to go for. Um, so uh, we're going to do the connect battles here. There's a variety of them. Uh, we'll start with this one. This is going to be the one you're going to farm. And especially if you're new, what you're going to be farming the most. So uh, these here are going to help you uh, level up or power up your Attack on Titan characters that are specific to them. And uh, you can get, yeah, for these characters here specifically. So you're going to go to choose difficulty. We'll just go to, I don't know, like this one here. And you'll go to multiple. So you want to do multiple because other people can join you. And also you get additional rewards that way. So the characters with the multiple arrows up like the three arrows up, that means you'll get additional rewards for having them in your party. So you'll be able to get uh, this guy here, um, Rainer, I think his name was. Uh, you'll be able to get him a piece of cake and you can put him in your party. Uh, and if you have happen to have some of the first clap characters around, they get a stat boost. If you don't know who to bring in, um, you can click this here on the left and you can see who other people are bringing in and like the rate of which they're bringing them in, that's pretty cool. And then also you can do that with the weapons too. So I feel that's pretty helpful. I think one of the best things about Barracker Connect is um, some of the quality of life things that they have. It's all very fluid, smooth, and it's easy to get to everything. And they, they thought of quite a lot because they've been, <laughs> they've been in the game for a while. Um, so, and you do that, you'll fight the boss loot will drop and you rinse and repeat and you want to get those tokens so you can spend them on what I showed you before uh, you know go, getting all the ex, uh, all the redeemable items uh, here are a couple other connect battles you can do this uh, I think it's once a day yeah um, you you fight Levy here or Levi not Levy Levi <laughs> uh, and uh, so you do that on each difficulty once a day I haven't done the first level yet but you get some additional rewards that way uh, make sure you do that every day and here is the EX fights so this is gonna be more for like uh, experienced players because these are like pretty tough um, now you may be able to get some of the collab characters because they have a boost to um, They'll have they'll have a boost, a, a stat boost, uh, but or actually I guess it's just him. I thought it was the others as well, so I'm actually wrong on that. It's just Rainer here that's got the boost. So if you're brand new, this will be pretty difficult. I don't know if it's possible to get strong enough to beat this in the time that this is out. I'm not sure. Maybe if you're lucky or a heavy spender, I'm not really sure. But uh, that's EX is typically more for experienced players. Um, there's also special challenges here at the right. 
Um, you want to make sure to do these as well. So they'll have some Attack on Titan uh, specific ones. Uh, you can even get uh, a border for like your well, player icon. Uh, you want to do this at level 7, either solo or with other if, or hosting it. You could get lucky, try to host it, have people join you. You might be able to beat it that way. Um, if you're new, uh, that's one way to try to do it. You used to be able to join other people's and get it, but they, they x nade on that one. Um, here is another item that you can get. You want to get a lot of copies of this if you can. It could be difficult because it's on the extreme version, so this could be for more experienced uh, players. Uh, but it's pretty cool you get this little little emote there. Um, this is nice too. So for upgrading uh, Rainer, uh, you'll get more of this stuff to be able to upgrade him more and more. So uh, as well as you know regular missions, this is how you can get more uh, uh, diamonds and more, uh, you know, food, more stamina to keep playing and do more of those raids over and over again, or the, uh, connect battles, I mean. So that's one thing to do there. I did forget to mention that there's a specific item that you can get doing the higher difficulties of this connect battle specifically here that you're going to want to farm a lot anyways. I think it's up to like level, was it like six when it pops up? Oh, maybe it's, uh, Let's see, this here? Okay, so this right here is what I'm talking about. Um, so this drops at a certain difficulty. Um, so this is something you want to go for if you can. What is it? Uh, level 7. So this is how you get that border, uh, but also how you get uh, this item here, which seems pretty freaking sick to me. Um, I'll have to work on getting that one. Other than the connect battles, there's also a scenario event. So if you click on here, this is going to be kind of like a story that you can go through and you can do it on three different modes. So obviously you complete one mode, the next one will unlock, but it's a great place to get diamonds. But it also uh, does tell like a little story of, you know, why the attack on Titan characters are typically here, things like that. Um, so uh, pretty cool. Uh, a lot of times you'd be able to get uh, exclusive items from here too. I'm not sure if that's the case this time, but it, at least it's a great place to get diamonds. So that's worth knowing. So as you can see right here, this is season one and there's 12 days left of this. So normally there's a second season that, that comes out that maybe has like additional uh, uh, connect battles or uh, more characters to summon on, things like that. Well, we'll see what, what comes of it. Uh, I'll cover it whenever that comes out. Uh, but now we can move into the summons here. So there's two banners. There's the Attack on Titan box summon one which it's showing me the items right now, which you can get in here exclusively. So you can get Aaron. I call him Edgy Aaron. I don't really know the story of why he looks like that. But, uh, and then there's Levi there. Pretty sick. Um, and then some items for them specifically. Then you get Mikasa here. That's, this is for the second box. And then Armin. See, I know them. I know those characters. I just don't know the, the free one. Uh, it's gonna be one of those things like the Black Clover collab. Like I did the Black Clover collab on here I thought the characters were cool, but I just hadn't watched it yet But now that I've watched it I'm like man I wish I got all those characters because I like that show a lot, but uh, there's another banner here These are from the first collab um, So what you can do is click this here and these are free so you click this so uh, it'll have highlighted with this little red dot here who you don't have so I actually don't have Mikasa So this is cool so I can pick her Use this here. This doesn't cost any gems. I don't know how many times you could do this, but it's guaranteed to get one of the characters. So this is also a good way to kind of build up some fodder stuff, build up these characters, and you want to rank them up as you're getting them. That way, hey, I got a ultra rare item. That's cool. Um, you want to level the characters up like their rarity, their stars. That way whenever you get their duplicates later on, it, instead of getting you just a duplicate... Oh, Levi. Oh, okay, so it's not guaranteed to give you that character, but it's guaranteed to give you a collab character. Got it. Um, but maybe it's just a higher chance of getting the one you picked. Okay. But anyways, instead of getting a, just a duplicate of the character while I was trying to explain with the stars, you get a permanent stat boost instead. So uh, that's good to know. So every time you do this, you will get uh, 
a guaranteed clap character. That's sick. That's exciting. I thought I was only going to get to do it once. Cool, cool. And you want to get duplicates of these as well, so you can star them up. Um, these items. Oh, they're already giving you at level 5. I didn't even notice that. Oh, whoops. Wow, that's awesome. For Especially for new folks. Now, these... Um, okay, so I guess that was it. Um, okay. I thought I was going to get to do it more, but we're all learning together. <laughs> I, I must have misread that. But... Uh, uh, that's pretty cool that they gave you a chance to get some of the old ones. They'll probably bring it back with Season 2, I would assume. Uh, which will be, you know, a couple weeks or so. But now we will do some summons here. So, let's see. We do Box 1 or Box 2. Hmm. So, I'm going to probably do Box 1. So, just so you know how this works, it's a box. So, think uh, like a box of cards, maybe. Uh, that. But anyways, you will eventually get... The character in the box there's 200 items in here and it's only a matter of time before you get them so that's the pity system in the box uh, i prefer some of the other ways of doing it but at least it's a guarantee to get the character that you're looking for eventually um uh, i don't know how far i'll be able to go for each box or anything but uh we'll, let's let's just see what our luck is like here so we'll start with box one because i like levi a lot Throw the sword down. I believe you're looking for feathers when it falls down. This is not good. This is like a bunch of whatever stuff. So we'll skip this. Uh, we'll also look at the shop about what those coins are about here in a second. These here. So you can uh, do this in an exchange shop as well and get additional things. I'll show you that at the end. So we'll do this again. Throw it down. Okay, so you want it to be rainbowy, so that's one of the rarer things that we're looking for, but I don't know if it's going to be uh, a collab character or not. Probably not. Um, I think... I don't think it's going to be a collab character. I don't know why the sound effects aren't going on. I guess it was just this item here. Throw it down. That's a bad one. We skip those. Yeah. Uh, this can be used to, you know, further power up your characters later on. So these are still useful. These things are still useful, but it's just, you know, it's not the character we're looking for. <laughs> so it's not junk. Okay, there's something. One. So this was probably the item that we got, the, the rare one. So we'll skip the rest. Yeah, yeah, okay. And we'll go again. Okay, that's good. One there. Nothing. Nope. Nope. What's the rare one? The sword. Okay. Skip the rest. Oh, the sword's pretty good. Attack up. Attack up 30%. So this is kind of what I was talking about where the items are not just stats. It'll do things like on yourself. It'll do 30% attack up for two turns and mag uh, magic defense up for 30% for two turns. Things like that. It'll uh, and, it, and it ranges to quite different things. Either attacking your opponent with that or buffing yourself. It's, it's a lot. So the items are really important in this. And even the way that you put the items on your inventory like the order will make them go first or next second last um so it's it, it's simple combat but it can uh, be deep it's just more on how you set up your team and everything so oh that's a bad one we skipped those not the best luck so far with this luck we probably won't be able to go into the next box it's not like i had a whole butt ton of uh, gems anyways but maybe if we're lucky we can get something in here that's a bad one bad equals not the character <laughs> it's 
still useful. I want the character. Okay, there's something. One. Look at why the sound effects stop working here. That's funny. Got another duplicate of the sword. So I think if, as long as you have like two of like the original items, you can use like reforge uh, equipment that of like the same rarity. You can kind of get it to the max. But you need, I think you need at least a couple copies of it. Um, but that might take time to get those other items. Keep going. Go down. Ooh, three of them. There we go. We got a boy. Man, he looks awesome. I've heard some mixed things about like the the older nice. The this is great. Got lucky there. So I could pretty much stop there if I really wanted to. Um, and I got one of the more rare items from it as well. Very cool, very cool. Let's uh, take a look with what's left to see if it's even worth... Because uh, I don't think... So there's 90 items left here. Let's see, there's more duplicates of the scout regiment, military uniform. That could be cool. Um, that might be useful. Seems decent. Three allies with the highest attack skill gauge up 6%. Um, I'll think about it, uh, but I got the characters, uh, but then you can, you know, it, it just depends. I'll think about it, but uh, I'll probably sleep on it. Maybe we'll see what happens next season. Maybe I'll do some summons for these characters here. Let's see, but I got, I got the two characters I was looking for. Uh, so let's go to the uh, trader's shop here, and I'll kind of show you um, this here. So this is what you can spend some of your currency on to, uh, you know, whatever you want here. So there's the original characters here if you wanted. To, to, to today's standards, they're not that great, but I still use them uh, just for fun. Uh, like I still use Levi plenty. Uh, you know, that's just me. I like to play with my collab characters, but they're better characters than this now. And especially the new ones are going to be much better than them. But hey, they're pretty cheap. It's only 50 each. Uh, but uh, there's a character here that you can get that's going to be pretty strong. That might be more worth your while if you have enough. It's like 600. Uh, if you go do the full box, you'll have enough for this. Uh, uh, plenty. Uh, and then there's also box two. And you can get the characters there as well. Uh, and uh, here's another character you can get with the exchange shop. You, can, you really only need one copy of like these characters. You don't have to sweat getting both copies of them or anything because there's hero missions. Each character has like a hero mission that has a little story which is pretty cool and then you can get diamonds that way and then also it will give you all the resources that you need to level them up as much as you need to for the most part. Um, so uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, so just want to let you know this is what you do. This is where you also find the exchange shop because that's important to know. But yeah, guys, that's it for me. I'm going to actually uh, get my Rainer here. Uh, but that's going to be it for this collab. And uh, whenever Season 2 comes out, I'll definitely cover that. So if you like Valkyrie Connect or you like collabs, I do a lot of different collabs and mobile games and what have you. Uh, please subscribe. I also do fighting games and VR games, co-op games with my wife. If any of that is of interest to you, I'd really appreciate it. Trying to get to 6,000 subscribers, uh, that'd mean a lot to me. I know everybody says it, but it's true. Uh, but good luck in all your polls. Let me know if you have any questions. Also, the Reddit of Attack on Titan. I'm sorry, not Attack on Titan. Maybe them too, but Valkyrie Connect is very helpful. Um, they're willing to answer any questions. But if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, I'll do my best to answer them. I uh, answer or reply to as many comments as possible. But thank you guys for watching. God bless you, and you have a blessed day, y'all.